Yo, yo, what it do? Welcome back. This is part two of our lyric breakdown, man. Thank you for tuning back in. Uh, we just broke down the first section. Now we talking about the second section where we get to Dennis the Menace playing tennis. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so we back again, man. Let's get right back into it. Let this bitch ride. Dennis the Menace playing tennis and don't even know the rules to it. Do it. Fuck it, I'll do it anyway, girl. Just send it, don't edit the minutes cause I almost screenshot it. No. Really, I'll do it anyway, girl. Don't get crazy, I won't get lazy. Forget to tell you when I'm coming. Fuck around and leave it in anyway. Come quick, real slick. Tell I won't leave the night by 3 a.m. Sleep God anyway. Yeah, I'm an ass up. Now that shit was fucking fire. So uh, we went into the second section, man. And I really had this thought. I had this idea of like I wanted to change up the flow. And I wanted to do like something that sounded like a bridge. Like how they always repeat some sort of section, some sort of flow. Uh, so with this one, it was in any way. I, I ended everything with any way. Uh, so, you know, I opened up just kind of randomly. I didn't know where I was going to go with this section. So I just was like, fuck it. What's the most random thing I can think of? And it was playing tennis, uh, as, you know, as a kid. And I had no idea what the fuck I was doing. Uh, and so I was like, okay, well, like I was like Dennis the Menace, man. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, but I was out here trying to have fun. So Dennis the Menace playing tennis. I don't even know the rules to it. Fuck it. I'll do it anyway. <laughs> you know, kind of speaking on like, I'm down to do anything at least once. You know what I mean? Uh, and then I kind of move into just some like weird shit, uh, kind of thinking like an asshole. Like if I was in the mind of Dennis the Menace moving forward in life, I'd probably become an asshole. And so how would that asshole go about life? Uh, you know, this would be the guy in today's world uh, speaking on like the next line. I kind of speak on like the Snapchat stuff of like, you know, go ahead, send it over, girl. I ain't gonna screenshot it, uh, but I'm gonna do it. But like fingers crossed, I'm gonna do it anyways. Uh, and then I kind of move on like, oh, like now we've moved ahead in our relationship. You know, so now we together, we, you know, we, we fooling around, whoop de whoop, whatever, whatever. And I'm like, oh, no, don't worry, girl. Like, I'll tell you when I'm coming, like, well, you know, whatever, whatever. Because a lot of dudes out here, especially in today's society with millennials, Gen Z's, whatever, like, we think we're fucking invincible. So, like, nothing bad could ever happen to us. Ah. Uh, and so, like, oh, don't get crazy, girl. Like, you know, I'm a, I'm a pull out game is strong, fam. Like, you know what it is. Uh, you know, so it's like. It's like, this dude is like, oh, like, fuck it. Like, it feels so good. I'm going to leave it in. And then now it's an issue that he don't got to deal with. And that's an issue with me because I know that that happens a lot. I've had it happen to friends. I've had it to happen to associates where, like, one night stands, fling, short-term relationships, even long-term relationships where they ain't ready. Like, they just get overconfident. Um, and then that's where, like, in this scenario, he's an asshole who's not here to stick around uh, so I kind of wrote it in like a come quick, real slick, tell I won't leave the night by 3 a.m. sneak out anyway. So kind of saying like, oh, well, this dude came quick and this would be the dude that like he busts a nut and then he don't even fucking help help the girl bust a nut. You know, it's like she deserved to get off too, man. Fuck. Uh, you know, and then he's like, oh, I'm going to stay like I'm going to stay and cuddle, whoop de whoop, whatever. And then he's like, peace, bitch, sneaking out the window. And, you know, so I'm just kind of touching on, like, that whole thing. Like, what what is the persona of an asshole dude 20-something years old on Tinder in today's society? So, like, that's what that was. Uh, that's kind of where I went with that. And that's what leads us into our next section, Yeah, I'm an Asshole, uh, which kind of ties in the next section with this section as well. So, till next time, man. Thank you again to everyone streaming up. That's all, folks. Please continue to share that shit out. I uh, appreciate anyone streaming it, loving it. Thank you so much. Uh, till next time, peace.